going to see a new update in the NIOS website. What is that? Let's check. So for that, first you have to go to NIOS page and then go to the learners cor corner. There you have got study material. Click on that. Now a new page appears where you have the senior secondary courses. Click there and a new update has come like syllabus bifurcation of senior secondary courses okay we can click here and find out what it is and if we want to see for a particular subject we can see here itself so i'm clicking here on computer science then appears the page of computer science with the syllabus change here what are the changes in the syllabus let's click on this give a right click open it in a new tab so this is the new updation that has happened so if you see the previous one or the last year or, or what we were following was based on this one this was the content where you had the first chapter under TME here you can see you had TMA for this chapter computer fundamentals and then till chapter 11 you had TMA and then for public examination you had from this introduction to C++ to new trends in computing all the everything is included here but now the new syllabus change or bifurcation you can say that means that syllabus is being divided into two, two branches you can say so what are the changes let's see here if you see some questions or some chapters come comes under tma for example computer fundamentals computer software email open source resources introduction to c++ before c++ was under public examination now it has come under TMA okay so these all chapters you can see listed under TMA comes in TMA that means you will have a future mark assignment that you have to write and give in a particular time that is being there now next one is public examination for your public examination to two types are there that is one is objective type another one is subjective type for objective type you have some chapters from these chapters you will have questions based on multiple choice options that means you will be having two uh, sorry you will be having four options and you have to mark one answer that is what objective means so these all chapters binary logic communication or internet spreadsheet digital presentation control statement function pointer files inserting images and list in a web page these all comes under objective type questions category next one is subjective that you have that means you have to write description descriptive answers for the same so in that you may have uh, two marks or four marks like that questions where you have to write like essay type answers so that will be coming from operating system chapter data communication that digital documentation and other things you can see here listed on this right most side so this is the change in the syllabus but this is not applicable for october batch it may be applicable from next year maybe from april 2024 so don't worry about it it's a new updation just i wanted to inform you about this so here just go through this it's available in all the subjects you can take each and every subject this way just go to that particular subject and then click there you will find this pdf right there otherwise it is available um, it's also available here after study material you have to go to the senior secondary courses and you can click here you will get for all the subjects what are the changes you can see here this is for hindi this is for english you can see my first steps will be under tma 
leisure chapter is under TMA that we have covered and these are the chapters to be covered and then for objective questions you will have these chapters that is chapter 7, chapter 10, 13, 16, 18 all under this okay and subjective are these chapters included okay objective and subjective will be there for PE exam and TMA will be covered with different chapters it is not same as the previous one okay so that is how you can check for all the subjects for Bengali and then you have got Tamil so this way you can search for each and every subject from here that is one option or otherwise go to the particular subject and then there itself for that subject the details will be given okay so this will be much easier than the old pattern you have a clarity of chapters which should be coming in the examination for your public exam so i think this will be a better option to get good marks in the exam and have a good percentage okay thank you for watching do subscribe and give a thumbs up and don't forget to share it with your friends thank you